Hi. So in the summer of 2022, my family and I went to Uzbekistan. We were always fascinated by Uzbekistan because it has so many different cultural things going on. It was part of the Soviet Union. It was um, also where the Mughals came from to India. Babur came from there. Um, yeah, so we wanted to see what the culture is like and what the people are like and just a very fascinating place. Um, we've always heard about it, so we wanted to go visit. And it was so close to us, so we thought that would be the perfect place for my parents, me and my grandparents to go. We went to three cities, Tashkent, Samarkand and Bukhara. This video will show you arriving in Tashkent and then going to Samarkand. And then the next video will show you Bukhara and then coming back to uh, Tashkent and spending some more time in Tashkent. Um, so I hope you enjoy it. Yeah, it's like Moscow. How fun! And that's what I'm seeing. Yeah. We are in Tashkent, Uzbekistan, and right over here is the statue of Amir Temur. Uzbekistan. Our first stop is Tashkent, then we go to Samarkand, then we go to Bukhara. Hello, hello, one, two, three. The great thing about Uzbekistan is tea. They know how to have tea, they know how to make tea, they know um, how to not spoil the tea. Uzbekistan for tea. And the food. We'll tell you later about the food. This is the tallest tower in Central Asia. It was built 50 years ago. That's the big deal. We are at Chorsu Bazaar um, buying some traditional things. Tashkent is a mix of the old and the new. We're in the old parts of Tashkent right now. Yeah. 
Uzbekistan is very different from any other place that I've been to. So Uzbekistan used to be a Soviet country, but now it isn't. And it's a secular country, but it has a lot of Muslim people and like Muslim food, Muslim culture, masjids, fashion. But it's not at all strict. Um, and just the other influences like Chinese, Mongolian, um, Northern Indian, Afghani, um, Irani because Iranian because Persia Persia was part of Persia and we're in a city called Samarkand. Samarkand is one of the most influential cities I would say historically on the world. Um, it's a part of history that we don't really look at because it's Eastern but we're here and we're going to explore and when we were coming to Uzbekistan, people were like, why are you going to Uzbekistan? That's weird. But I think we'll find out why we're here. Samarkand's the place that Babur came to India from. Babur was part of the Amir Tamur family. And um, I know in India, it's usually looked down upon just the figure Amir Tamur and his lineage and uh, Babur as well. I don't know if he has a good rep, but in, a, in in Uzbekistan, Babur and Amir Temur are both big figures and today we will see their palaces, their masjids, eat their food, hopefully. Yeah, and I'll take you guys along. <laughs> Happy birthday! No, it's not good.
Trains are a big thing in Uzbekistan. The railway station of Samarkand that I just saw is perhaps the best railway station I've seen in my life. And uh, this particular bogey is the restaurant, which is written in Russian, which I recognize. No people coming. Here comes our train. It was a bullet train, I missed the beginning. The luggage going on. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed this. Stay tuned for part two.